Hey guys, Penda Daily here, and welcome back to Let's Play Destiny of the Oracles. In the last episode, we made it here to Nehru's level 6. And we also made it to Din's level 6. And we got the map. So let's take a look. Shock. This is Banjo-Kazooie music, I'm fairly sure. Okay. So, we're going to have to get up. Hmm. Let's see. If I push that up, that down, that over, hmm, I can push this. Like that. And that. Or maybe it's not. I don't know. Oh no, this is Mario music, sorry. I recognize this, sort of. Didn't really need to do that, but it's fine. Oop, wrong way. Push it here, and... Over! And we go up. And out. And in. And we have Gaster Blasters. That's a key door. Yeah, that's what I thought. So yes, I killed everything, but eh. So obviously, we need to come back here later. And as you can probably guess, we're going to get swimming ability in this dungeon. Get the compass! Yay! There we go. And... There. As you can guess, we can't actually get from one way to the other just yet, so... Uh, you know what? Knowing what I do about redads, I have no idea if that was supposed to be quite that easy or not, but hey. Alright, and we can hit the wrong button. We can get back across. Very nice. Alright. I do like this music, it's... Mario has some very good music, it's... I can't remember which... The N64 was not really my, um... Water whiz robes and gaster blasters. The way to our treasure is carefully guarded. If you can reach the door to our master, you will almost be worthy of what we have to offer. Sure, whatever. Um, I'm gonna kill the gaster blaster. Right. And just avoid the whiz robes. Because they're dicks. Right. Oh, boy. Alright. Fine, you want to be that way? We gotta do it with this, I guess. There we are. Now the rest of it should hopefully be fairly easy. Maybe I'll cut out my stupidity there. I don't know. 
This block puzzle wasn't as hard as I was making it out to be. I was just overly attached to my own cleverness, so to speak. Yeah. I'm ignoring you guys if I can possibly do so. Alright, not too much we can do here, so um, I think we have to backtrack. Yes, we do. And we get some more stuff, and we go through the door. Yeah, this is a... You have to basically just light where the fire was last. See where I end up and I will give you what you want. Yeah. So that opened that door. Yeah. Obviously we can't get that for a while. Right. Yeah, you remember we... Yeah. And now we... Yeah, that's... That's the door to the boss. But hey, we have a warp now. And can go this way. And we get this again. And whiz robes! I'm going to kill two of these whiz robes, then go back out and come back in. There we go. So that I only have to dodge one of them while I'm trying to do this crap. goes through a few too many cycles, Yukles. Three probably would have been enough to make things. Evident. You hear the sound of a door opening in the destiny. Check where you've been before. Well, we'll do that since we can't do anything else here. All right. Was this faster? Probably not, but eh. enough to the jerk to get killed or to get paralyzed by the freaking scream have to kill everybody here go through the warp at least here there's only four of them to keep track of And we get a key. 
Yeah, okay, it's always the same, so eh. And we go through the door. Alright, so let's see. That was not what I wanted to do. Yeah, we're going to just come back through here, and I'm going to do this a bit less badly. Okay. And we opened that. So come in here. Well, let's let's go through here first, I think, because it was already open. I don't know that it means anything, but eh. Can't do anything there. Right, we've been in here before, and that's the that's the thing. Okay. I wonder where this leads. Hello? completely different part of the dungeon. Oh, hey. Okay, so something opened up back somewhere else that we've been, so that was probably good to do this right now. Ah, we're certainly getting a fair amount of money, aren't we, children? All right, so now we go down. I managed to do it without falling in the water this time. Can you say probable mini boss? I knew you could. Yeah, alright. Uh, let's see. The thing looks familiar, but I cannot place it right off the top of my head. Regardless, we have killed it. <laughs> I'm sorry, there was just something very strange about that. Now we can swim. Yay! That's going to be very important for this dungeon. For, you know, getting around the map for not having to do those freaking puzzles anymore. Okay, you just move into those and it moves you to the second, f the bottom floor of the map. Let's see, we got Gibdos, we got Cheap Cheeps, we got Bloopers. Somebody's a fan of Link's Awakening. I don't know, maybe. And we got a key. Get the hell out of here. Yeah, you don't have to press anything, just... Actually, it occurs to me... We can now come over here. Do we want to? Well, we haven't been this way. You know what? I'm coming back to there. Let's go down first. And another key. Very important. Yeah, let's... Okay, fine. Let's see what... I don't know. No, we'll do this first. It's, it's closer and probably... 
Okay. Okay, good to know. Water Riz robes. Um. Your magic shield will stop their shenanigans. back in. Pardon me? Okay. Yeah, we can't, you can't submerge to dodge part of projectiles, sadly. Nor can we murder anybody while we're swimming, so keep that in mind. This area is kind of easy to get lost in, too. Oh good, I was fast enough. first because they do that thank you the cheap cheeps are fast but they don't really get you f they're not as um they don't get you from a distance the way the uh, bloopers do And by the way, you can't use ember seeds underwater. Duh. Right. Right. Okay. I wanted to get that blooper from a distance so he wasn't exploding squid at me. I, I think uh, Kraken, you know, deep sea squid can explode. Got a key? Got entirely too many creeps. Got more creeps. You goals! I do that. Good. Hmm. And then back out and come in. I wasn't as bad as I was afraid. Um, and down. Yeah, I'm probably gonna wind up needing another key, but you know how it is. At least I know where to go if I do. Get 
knocked back and I'll just not bother with you any further. Yup! Alright. Yeah, I'll probably cut out the backtracking for that. Yes, they'll be back when I go through here, but I kinda had to. Well, I didn't have to, but it, I didn't want to get hurt. Eh. And I'm back, so we're gonna go through this portal. Swim down through here. Really? Let's try to get away from there so that... Yeah. <sighs> Knockback shenanigans. Gotta love them. Not. So how's everybody doing? We got snowed in at my place. Like, literally, my mom's car got stuck in the... Ugh. My mother's car got stuck in the driveway. The, there was a pile of snow at the end of the driveway that the snowplow had plowed up. And my mom's car got stuck in it. So that's going to have to go up. Can't go any other direction. So this will have to already be moved. Okay, if I do that, it's okay, I think. Great. Not what I wanted to do. I think that's... I, I'm gonna go... I'm gonna reset that. Let's try that again. Okay. Hmm, I think I can put that up. other people. <sighs> I really, th this wavering filter to show you're underwater, it's really bad for anybody who's got any kind of visual sensitivity or motion sickness. I mean, it's bothering me, and I'm really not that bad with motion sickness. Uh, the color, personally, I think the color filter would have been sufficient. Thank you. There we go. the way through here, but I can. <sighs> okay. Oh. This is actually, that's what you have to do. You have to, it's the same as the, um, fires. You look for the one that, where the eye is not showing. And you have to shoot it when it stops. When it basically, once the empty eye stops. You know what I mean. Luckily, it won't detect your shot unless you shoot the right one, so you can brute force it, which is good, because it's kind of hard to tell which one's which in here. 
And we get a key! So, now I'm gonna go, uh, back... Well, we're gonna cut some of this crap out. We're gonna cut my backtracking out. So, uh, I will meet you back where we were. Okay, we're back. I just don't feel like killing those guys. Alright, I suspect we have another mini-boss. And I think I remember what this mini-boss is. I'm wrong. Yeah, I was afraid of that. There we go. These, this guy, on the other hand... Did I cheese those guys? Probably. Do I feel shame? Of course not. Yeah, we don't have the big key yet, do we? But, we can go that way. However, we've been doing this half an hour, so I'm gonna save it here. So, thank you guys for joining me for Let's Play uh, <clears throat> Destiny of the Oracles, and I will see you next time. Have a great evening. Goodbye.